BVI Airways, the airline whose takeoff was intensely anticipated as the territory's flag carrier has laid off its entire flight crew with immediate effect. The airline announced the shocker on July 80, noting its decision was the result of ongoing delays. BVI Airways was initially slated to fly in October then November of 2016, then June of this year, and then again on July 22, according to Miami International Airport, whose CEO Jerry Willoughby said jumped the gun in making that pronouncement. The latest bombshell comes exactly two weeks after the airline blamed the Dr. D. Orlando Smith administration for missing its original commercial launch date. The premier shot back that the government had fully discharged its responsibility to BVI Airways by providing $7 million in subsidy and that he hoped there would be no further delay. Well, BVI Airways has now confirmed that there will be an indefinite delay and explained why. The airline says, quote, we have the planes, the organization, and have secured all the difficult regulatory approvals. The regulatory process also took much longer than all parties expected and has put a significant strain on the company's finances. The pre-operating carry costs alone have cost us millions of dollars over the past year and have depleted most of our cash reserves. The irony is, now that we are ready to start flying, we need to raise more money in order to do so, end quote. BVI Airways says other factors which compounded its commercial takeoff include what it describes as the government's ill-timed announcement of the contract award to lengthen the runway at Beef Island. The airline also mentions the government's failure to complete contractually agreed improvements to the TB Letsum International Airport in order to reduce the processing time for the expected increase in passengers, arguing that the continuation of the existing two-hour wait would be disastrous. Meanwhile, opposition leader Andrew Foy, who recently asserted that cows would fly over the moon before BVI Airways takes flight, states that the government must tell the whole truth and nothing but the truth, as after spending $13 million to address the airlift problem, there is nothing to show for it. Nonetheless, BVI Airways says it continues to work through the remaining issues with the government, adding that it hopes the layoffs will be short-term and that flights will commence shortly.